Hi everybody and welcome back to Thrift Witch. I have a really tiny haul of items to show you this evening. Uh, I went to the thrift store on the way to a friend's place today and I picked up a few items. First item is this vintage Florida tourist tray. I've picked up a few of these, um, a couple of them actually in the original packaging. Uh, the Florida tray is really pretty with the with the really nice uh, hibiscus flower on it. This one's not in perfect condition. It's got a little bit of scratching. Still a really cute um, touristy piece. Next are a couple items that I picked up for myself. Um, a few thank you cards. I do like to send thank yous. On, um, these I thought were really pretty. I think they're... Um, I'm pretty sure they're uh, they're from Regal in Canada. Um, and there's I know the artist name, but I can't remember it right now. Um, so I just picked up those for myself in a bag, as well as a bag full of just like miscellaneous cards. Um, I have turned into my mother because now I find keeping on hand get well, sympathy, birthday cards, etc. Um, is really handy. Um, so I picked these up just to have a bunch of cards on hand for all occasions. I think my favorite items that I picked up at this trip were these three painted sad irons. So these are really heavy. These are cast iron sad irons. There's three different ones here and each has been painted. Um, and I really think these are folk art. I, this, sorry, this first one here is of a man and I think a boy or a girl and they're going fishing, I think. And this one here is of geese on the front and then on the top edge, some other birds and the sky scene. And then this one I think is a man maybe duck hunting or otherwise hunting um, along a shoreline. Each of these are signed. There are initials on them. I think it's probably TJ or TG, uh, 94, 93, and 95. I think these are great. I think they're, I think they're folk art, and I think that um, I, I just really like the look of them, and they're a really neat little collection, so I picked those up. Next are a couple vintage um, glasses in this green. Um, my sister actually has the picture and some other glasses for this set, so those are going to be going to her. This is a Crown Devon uh, Ewer, E-W-E-R, Ewer, which is like sort of like a jug with a handle in, the, in a really nice pink with the white interior. Really nice little piece. Then in a bag, I picked up some Wilton cake uh, decorations. Some of these, especially the ones that are really vintage, can actually be worth quite a bit of money. Um, these are in the original packages. I picked up Marvin the Martian, um, happy birthday candle, some Dalmatian candles, and um, a package of Sesame Street cake decorations, uh, also in the original packaging. So these aren't crazy old and aren't worth a whole bunch each, but definitely worth picking up in a bag for $2. And then the other thing that I bought on this trip was some artwork. I bought this really big piece of needlework nicely framed with um, like a, a green velvet matting and then a nice wooden frame and it's of a girl under a tree um, she's I think she's carving initials into the tree um, with her dog watching this is a really nice piece it's quite large I I love vintage needlework or I just think about all the hours and effort that went into making these and then the time and the effort and expense to have them framed and so I've been thinking about doing a wall of vintage needlework just to sort of show people what it can look like to put together a collection like that so if I gather up enough pieces and don't take them all over to the booth at the same time I might do a mock-up on a wall in one of my bedrooms um, so I've been thinking about that with these pieces um, another piece of needlework that I picked up today is this, I think they're hydrangea blossoms on this nice blue background in an oval frame. And then a little, a little impasto or oil painting of a, 
a jug of red roses. I just liked it. I thought it was pretty, so I picked it up to sell because I think somebody else will think it's pretty too. So that was really it. It was a it was a quick trip. I had somewhere to be. I think I got a few items and a couple things for myself. And so yeah, um, I don't know where all the cats are. We might be able to call one. Hang on, let's try. <whistles> Eugene. <whistles> Eugene. Anybody? <whistles> Maybe. Oh, Zoe. Hey, come here. She's not that interested. Zoe, come here, sweetheart. All right, well, in typical cat fashion, she's not that interested in coming over. We tried. All right, everybody, that's it from the Thrift Witch today. Thanks for watching. Bye.